everyone and welcome to the vlog. I just realized how crazy my hair looks right now, but it's super humid outside because it's rainy. <sighs> Pretty sure it's like gonna be raining for like the next few days. Oh, tired. McKenna woke up so much last night. Um, so I had a neurologist appointment this morning. We just finished up. It was like the quickest appointment ever. Super fast, just in and out. He basically just wanted to know how it was going, like coming off of my one medication and switching to the other one. And it sounds like everything's going well. The nausea that I've been having is normal because I'm on both medications at the same time right now. I'm having the, the absence seizures and that could just be because I'm on both medications. It could be because there are days when I'm like really sleep deprived, but he wants to wait until I'm like totally switched over and see how things are then, like see if I'm still having them. And if I am, then he's gonna do an ambulatory EEG, which I never heard of before, but I looked it up and I was like, that's really weird. Um, but basically it's like an EEG that you do at home and it's like three days long, um, which I hope I don't have to do that because that just sounds like really annoying, especially like that along with taking care of McKinnon. I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> um, because like I'll have all those wires attached and then I have this little thing that I have to carry around with me that they're all attached to. But anyway, fingers crossed I don't have to do that. Right now we are heading to Starbucks to get me something to eat and probably some coffee. I don't want to get anything like too strong though because I'm already kind of like jittery. We'll see. Um, but I have two vlogs to get up today. One of them is basically, it's edited, but I have to add in Matthew's footage. So I need to get that up. Then I need to edit the Disney vlog and get that up today. So I have a busy day ahead of me. And Matthew has to go to work. He's like, it's a work day. And I said, not in my mind. In my mind, you're staying home today. <laughs> Isn't that what I said? I want to stay home and bake cookies with you. <laughs> that sounds great. We are currently sitting at Starbucks and I got a matcha green tea latte, which I'm about to try for the first time. I also got a blueberry muffin that I didn't want warmed up because I hate when they warm up the muffins. They warmed it up. Every time we ask them not to warm up a muffin at the Starbucks, they warm it up and it's so frustrating because Every I don't single like time. my blueberry muffins just warmed not up. Warm it up you jerks. <laughs> like it's less effort for them. I know but it's tastier for you if it's warmed up. No it's not. I like I it love not warmed up. Warmed up. Oh. Anyway, I'm going to try this. I've never had a matcha green tea latte, so let's try this. It's a good thing it's not a Russian nesting doll. We're not mm. talking about that. This is good. You should try it, Matthew. No, thank you. Matthew was like so tired driving home last night. For some reason, in the middle of the conversation, he said, at least it's not a Russian nesting doll. And I was like, oh, no, it was an egg. What? It was or, a nesting a, egg. Yeah, a Russian like, nesting what? egg. And I was like, what? You know, like and a he Russian was like, nesting doll. And he said, what did I just say? <laughs> and he was like, what were we talking about? And I was like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> he was so tired. He just randomly said that. <laughs> That's just been like an ongoing joke now. This is really good. I am currently editing the Disney vlog while also feeding this little girl. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna go to Walgreens to get my medicine. And then we're gonna go to Target to get a few things and also check out the Disney stuff before everything's gone. 
she's excited about the Disney stuff. Your two teeth are like so visible now. She like sticks her tongue out because she like feels her teeth. She does this because <laughs> she's feeling her bottom teeth. It's so weird. <laughs> so we're looking at all the Disney stuff and they have a lot. Here's like the like kind of like well, it doesn't look like it's. I was gonna say this is like the beauty stuff, but there's also pencils. It's like little right accessory there. stuff. Yeah, but there's bath bombs, Mickey bath bombs. So like, if you don't want to go to, um, what is that place? Basin Plush. Basin. Um, wow, I feel really like bad that I know both of those. Can't, if you can't go to Basin. <laughs> or Lush. Yeah, or Lush. They have Mickey, and they have um, bath gel. And what's interesting is these look a lot like the ones that are at the Disney Resorts, don't they? They do kind of. I wonder if they, they're cherry blossom. These nail polish. Sounds like my kind of red. I wonder how good the quality of it. <laughs> Cause what is the brand? It just says Disney. I'd hazard a guess it's L'Oreal. That's what I would think since this is L'Oreal. Eyeshadow palettes. There's this one and this one. Those look very similar. It's a whole gift set. It's a giant mug. With lollipops. And lollipops. Wow, that's a huge mug. Look how big it is. Put it next to your face. That's huge. It's huge. We found some more stuff. So these are some paper cups. And are these, let's see, $2? Or, okay, so that's drinkware blue. And it's $1.49, but... This is disposable is two dollars. Oh, I guess because you have a bunch of them. We have chairs. Oh, there's towels. This one with a little hood that is for kids. Fourteen ninety nine. Nine ninety nine. Oh, okay. I love these. Really want this one for McKinnon. Look at how cute this is. Tent. Tent thing like a little fun play tent. Oh my gosh, it's like going out of focus now. It's $60. It's $60? Yeah, I thought it was 10 I was going to buy it. But. Oh, but look at this chair. That is so cute. Is this like a kid's camping a chair? chair yeah. yeah, it looks like a tiny one. Yeah. Look at these little charms. You'll have to excuse Mickey Mouse Clubhouse on in the background, although it's kind of fitting for everything I'm about to show you. I'm going to show you all the stuff that we got from the Disney collection at Target. And I'll try to tell you all the prices. I'm gonna have to look at the receipt though. First is something I'm really excited about. These little hair tie bracelets. Okay, y'all probably noticed I always have a hair tie on me and I can't really wear bracelets because McKen will just pull on them and I'm always afraid she's gonna break them because she's pulled out my earrings before. So I just thought these would be super cute to have hair ties and then they have little Mickey Mouse 
um, charms on there. So I was like, that would be so cute. And these are $4. Matthew grabbed these two tall cups. He's always wanting drinks in like big tall cups. And we saw these and they were perfect. So he got a Mickey and Minnie. And each of these were $1.99, which is awesome for these. They're just plastic cups. Um, but they're really cute. Fourth of July kind of themed. Obviously, you can use them year round. I picked up this mug that I'm super excited about. I'm probably going to wash this and have my coffee in this in the morning. It's just a white mug with gold Mickey Mouse around and then gold candle. And this was $4.99. Amazing. I expected this to be like way more. I cannot believe that this is $4.99, especially because there weren't any prices on anything. We had to keep going and scanning stuff. So I assumed that it was like higher prices because usually when they don't put prices on things, they're higher prices, but this was really good pricing. Staying on the drinkware side of things, we got McKinnon, this little sippy cup a straw sippy cup she's not quite to the point of drinking out of straws yet but she's getting close she can drink out of straws like she can like suck out of a straw she just doesn't really use that yet but we got this cute little mini mouse she's wearing sunglasses and this is kind of like the ears are like silicone and the bow is silicone with like sparkles and the straw is like the same silicone. This was also $4.99. We got this pin set. They're not official Disney trading pins, so we can't trade them, but they're just super cute. So we wanted to add them to our pin board. Mickey Mouse, just a little circle pin that says Mickey Mouse and then a little Mickey outline that is done like Mickey. And these were $8. I think these were the most expensive thing out of everything. The last thing from the Disney line that we picked up is these sticky notes. You have Minnie Mouse with like polka dot background and then like Mickey Mouse shape down here and you can't really see but in the background you have like Minnie Mouse and stuff back there and these were two dollars so that is everything that we picked up from the Disney line at Target there were a ton of things I'm not gonna lie I really wanted that like play tent that they had but I didn't want to pay $60 for it. <laughs> but I'm going to wrap up the vlog now. Definitely if you are a Disney fan, which you most likely are if you are watching our vlogs because we vlog about Disney a whole lot. But if you are a Disney fan, go and check out the Disney line at Target because they have some great stuff and they're great prices. I will say that some of the stuff is just not good quality especially some of the beauty stuff there is like a makeup bag that like I'm pretty sure it only costs like a few dollars but I honestly wouldn't even buy it at that because it's just like not good quality there's like a sponge it's really weird but it's like the cheapest sponge you could get and they just like cut it in the shape of Mickey I don't know like what the quality of the makeup is I'm going to look up on YouTube and see if anyone has done like any reviews like any makeup gurus have done some reviews of the Disney makeup line and let me know if you have tried it out and what you think and we will see y'all tomorrow bye